Good morning, welcome to my channel. Today we will be learning or refreshing how to plot points on a graph. I have come across three different graphs I'd like to share with you. To start off with this one, when you start plotting points on a graph, you always start with your X line, side to side, and then you continue with your Y up and down. Right hand side X is always going to be positive. This one is always going to be negative. And going up on your Y, it's always going to be positive. And going down on your Y, it's going to be negative. So this graph right here, you always start on your zero, right in the middle. So for instance, we're going to plot this point right here. We will start always on your X line. We move one, two, two lines, and then we go up two, one, two. So it's a positive two to a positive two. Then we continue, if we want to do this point over here, again, you start on your X, we move two, which is a negative two, and we move up Y, which is a positive two. So that one is negative two to positive two, then we connect them. For this point right here, X again, we move to the left two spots, so negative two, and we go down two spots, negative two to a negative two. Then we connect this point right here. Again, we start on the X, middle, we move two points to the right, and we move two points down to the bottom negative two so positive two to a negative two we connect and it becomes your square okay this was the the four quadrant coordinate graph this is the one that you will most likely find when graphing any kind of picture, this is the one, the first one you're gonna find for a four quadrant. The next one is your just one quadrant. And this one, I believe for me, is the easiest one you can find and do. So on this one, we'll do this the square again. And for this right here, your line on the bottom is your X and your line going up is your Y. So your middle point. So we'll plot this point right here. You move two to the right and you move up two. So two to the second. And for this one right here, again, X, two to the right and up six. So we'll plot it together. Next one, we start on the X line and we moved six to the right and we will move six up and let's plot those in last one we move six to the right and we go up two so that's when you plot it and then attach for a graph, you obviously plot one right here, one right here, one right here, right here. And as you're plotting, um, let's say you find them on a graph, paper to graph, let's say an image, and it has the two six, and it has a two two, and it has a six six, and it has the six two. Then obviously you go like two six right here, you plot your point, it's gonna start it's gonna say start usually and then it has your points and then it'll say stop. If it says stop, that's where you connect and that shape is done. Then you continue with the next shape, which would be another set of coordinates. And then it will say start again, and then it will say stop. Okay, so this is the basic one. I feel like this one is the easiest one I have come across. And my last graph 
is this one. Kind of looks like the first one. The only difference with this one is the zeros are not lined up. The line is, but the zeros are not lined up. So you're kind of like, wait, so isn't the center right here? Shouldn't I start here? But no, not on this one. So as long as you stay on your X line, you should be good. So we start on our X line and our zero comes right here. So for this one, we're going to plot this first point right here. We're going to move. So X right here, one, two. It's a negative two and we go up two right here. Then we're going to plot this one right here. So we start one, two, and then we go up two. So two to the two and they're both positive. We're going to connect them. In here we're gonna plot this one right here so we're gonna move from 0 1 2 always working with your X line 2 to the right which is a positive and then we're gonna go down to 1 this one 1 2 we're gonna plot it right there and then this one over here we're gonna do the same thing X to, I mean, you're going to work on your X line and you're going to move to the left, 2, which is a negative 2, and you're going to go down to another negative 2. And you're going to plot them, and then your last point again, obviously you connect, and it would be your last one again, so right here. But you would see it again as your first point. So you're going to see negative 2 to the second on a graph sheet of points. It's going to say start, and it's going to have your 2 to the second positive. Then you're going to do positive 2 to a negative 2, and then you will find a negative 2 to a negative 2. And your last plot number would always be the one you started with first to be able to connect negative 2 to the second. That way you connect, because this one can't just jump right there. So, right there. And there is your three graph examples in how to start graphing. Always using your X line first, side to side, and then your Y up and down. Well, I hope it really helped you guys, and if you guys really liked it, and it was easy, just give it a thumbs up, leave me any comments, I have, maybe I missed something, and then I will get back on to you. Thank you, you guys have a great day. Bye.